So it's another beautiful brand new day, brand new night, depending on wherever you're watching me from. My name is Jimmy Ralph. Can you subscribe to this channel, like, comment, and always stay connected. Fun time, bro. So David Do, David Do, David Adeleke, aka OBO, David Do, the son of Mr. Adeleke, has been announced as the most followed celebrities across all the social media platforms I'm about to mention X, Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. X, which is formerly known as Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook. Yeah, he's the most followed celebrities on these four social media platforms, you know, and I don't know why they didn't add the likes of the Snapchats and or the other ones, you know, followed by the other musicians, yeah. On social media, the video is comfortably leading with over 56 million followers. Wow! And I know people sometimes do go like, do we eat numbers on social media? Do we eat numbers on social media? That's, you know, the perception of some people, some ignorant people. And I go like, I don't know why people in this 21st century, some people still choose to remain ignorant. Do you know what it means to be the most followed musician in your country or the most followed celebrity in your country? Go check Beyonce. Beyonce, how much Beyonce takes for posting just on Instagram? Just for posting one, like one post, how much uh, Beyonce charges for one post on Instagram? Over one million dollars. Go check C. Ronaldo. Over three point two million dollars for posting on Instagram. And even when you come to Ghana, I know uh, the last time I checked, Jackie Apia was charging more than twenty thousand dollars for posting on social media. On I mean Instagram, Jackie Apia. She charges more than $20,000. So just imagine you being the most followed musician in your country. It's not a joke, bro. It's not a joke. So reading from Daily Post, this is what I saw. Let's go check it out and come back. David Doe tops list of most followed Nigerians on social media. Reading from Daily Post, famous singer David Adeleke, aka David Doe, is number one on the list of most followed Nigerians on social media with a total of 56.1 million followers across various social media platforms. The OBO Corona sit comfortably at the top of the list released on Tuesday by entertainment statistic company Top Chart Africa. Grammy reigning singer Burner Boy is number two with 38.6 million followers. Closely followed by Wizkid with 38.4 million followers. Afropop Diva Yemi Alade and Tiwa Savage are tied with 34.3 million followers each, occupying number 4 and number 5 respectively. Actress Macy Johnson, 33.5 million followers. Music executive Don Jazzy, 30.1 million followers. Singer Simi, 29.9 million followers. Skit maker Mark Angel, 29.7 million followers, and actress Regina Daniels, 28.7 million followers complete the top 10 list in that order. The list was based on followers across four major social media platforms Instagram, X, formerly Twitter, Facebook, and TikTok. Yeah, so uh, we are about to wrap up 2023, right? The year is almost coming to an end and like i've been telling you all the digital streaming platforms all the social media platforms are coming out with their end of year recap they are coming out with their end of year recap and this time around they've got it uh how many they are the, uh, the amount of followers each and every nigerian celebrity got you know this uh was actually the top 10 yeah the one i just mentioned were just the top 10 and you know I think, yeah, it wasn't surprising seeing the likes of Don Jazzy in there. Yeah, Don Jazzy is one person who has been in the industry for many years and is still relevant. The likes of Missy Johnson. These people, like, friends, yeah, it's very good. Like, most of the legendaries do get followers on social media, right? They do get uh, followers, but the intensity of uh, people following them is nothing compared to the new guys yeah and so if you are a legend if you are a vet uh, if you're a veteran and you still manage to be part of the top 10 most followed celebrity in your country meaning you are actually doing something great bro you are actually doing something great look at uh uh i mean oh 
Yemi Allah, they look at to a savage. Look at like they are legendaries and they still manage to get you know this amount of followers. That's a very great thing, yeah. That's a very, very great thing. Shouts to them. Congratulations to all the people that were mentioned on the top 10. From Don Jazzy to Regina Daniels. From Don Jazzy. And you know, often with the, like these musicians, these people are also vibrant. They are also active on all these social media platforms. When you go to Instagram, Don Jazzy is almost on, like, Don Jazzy on Instagram. Always posting uh, skits, always promoting his own artists like Charlie. And he's also helping the younger ones. He's also helping the younger ones, yeah. So, congratulations to all these people. Congratulations to the video for leading the chat, bro. Yeah, the mula, Charlie. I'm waiting for my mula, bro. I'm waiting for all the distance, Charlie. It's very great. And, you know, congratulations to Risky too. You know, looking at 2023, Risky has not really been vibrant like the previous year because he didn't, you know, Risk it didn't have any hot banger apart from that uh, standard body band thing and then and even that one like he didn't really really promote the song well you know we all know what happened to uh him yeah losing the mom and you know recently he has even you know his uh donate i think he's donated more than hundred thousand dollars to you know kids in nigeria yeah charlie just uh you know just uh for the memories so of uh his mom yeah f just for the memories of his mom and you know a hundred thousand dollars so for a hundred thousand dollars yeah it's really some huge amount of money bro really huge amount of money yeah so once again congratulations to all the people on the list bro congratulations to all the people that were mentioned fun time bro so uh wait so oh, give me a minute let me check this thing uh okay 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 so um yeah on the 17th on the 17th of april on the 17th of april davido will be performing at the madison square gardens officially announced davido to perform at the madison square gardens on the 17th april 2024 on the 17th of yeah yeah, on April 17, 2024, Davido will be performing at the Madison Square Gardens. Yeah, we already know this kid did it. Uh, Burner Boy has done it. And now we are waiting for Davido. Very soon we'll be waiting for the other African musicians yeah, to do. But, like, I'm, I'm still wondering, what about, what are we doing as, you know, Africans? I'm, it's only the Nigerians doing all, though, Charlie. It's only the Nigerians doing all. I don't see any Nigerian uh, South African music try, uh, musician trying to, you know, fill any bigger venue. I don't see any Tanzanian musician. I don't see any Ghanaian musician, bro. How? Anyway, we are still waiting. Like, we are still waiting for, you know, it, I'm still waiting for that one musician from any other African country than Nigeria. Yeah, I'm waiting for that one musician from any other part of the African countries than Nigeria to, you know, break that record. We are waiting because, Charlie, it looks like we are, we, are, we, are, we, are, we are being lazy. Like, the Nigerians will make you look as if you are lazy. Yeah, serious. The Nigerians will make you look as if you are lazy. <laughs> Why? It's not. They are always putting pressure, Charlie. Like I told you, the pressure is too hot. Yeah, so, um... Uh, Risk it will be, I mean, David will be performing at the Madison Square Gardens and uh, Charlie, we are still waiting, yeah, we are still waiting and you know, the pressure of the Nigerian musicians is nowhere closer to the climax, yeah, the pressure of the Nigerian music industry, the pressure they are putting on the world at the moment is nowhere closer to the climax because looking at 2024, June 2024, man like Bernard Boy has even announced to perform at the distant the London Stadium again. Look at what he did this year. And he's going to be repeating that next year. And that's one thing I like, I like about the Nigerians at the moment. Because, you know, they know, you know, like, they are still coming up, yeah? They know they are still coming up. So, they can't compare themselves to the Americans. So, with the Americans, they will just announce uh, a show a few days to the distant. There. They will just announce uh, a show a few days to, you know, the events. 
yeah, they will just announce the show a few days to the event. Some of them do. Some of them will announce it to few days. But with the Nigerians, they'll announce it for you to prepare. Get prepared that, okay, I have a show in, let's say, next year. Or, let's say, in nine months time. I'm supposed to, you know, go uh, attend a, a Bernard Boy concert. Attend a Rima concert. Yeah, so like they always, you know, make you get prepared ahead of the show. It's not a civil, uh, it, it was just, uh, it's just recently that some Ghanaians are adapting to that culture. Look at Medical, he's about to perform at the O2 Indigo, and he has, you know, announced many months ahead of the show. So I'm sure that he will sell more tickets than like Medical, like I believe Medical will be able to sell more than the, you know, the, the total capacity of the Indigo. I believe so. I believe so. Looking at how he's preparing towards the show, I believe he'll be able to sell sellouts. He will be you oversell out. I believe. And if he's able to do that, meaning we should get ready for the first Ghanaian, or we should get ready for Ghanaian to fill the O2 arena. Yeah. Meaning we can. Yeah, we can, Charlie. We can know. But I don't know. We, the Nigerians are just being adventurous. We should just look. look the Nigerians are very adventurous. That one, the actually, that, that, that's one thing I like about you guys. You guys are very adventurous when it comes to stars, Charlie. Even if you lose, they'll still. And you know, at the moment, there are no more losing. Yeah, Rima filled the O2 Arena for the first time. You know, on his first attempt, and he was able to sell out. Yeah, so I feel like wow. So Charlie, congratulations to the video, and uh, yeah, congratulations to the video. Yeah, so. Uh, kindly subscribe to this channel, like, comment, and always stay connected. Fun time, bro. I'll be back with more. Yeah. Fun time. Jimmy Ross. Flat again, see the play on the street with the do things you can't imagine. But boys never play with a high grade. But boys never give up on streets. Depression killer we as we keep grinding, chasing the mullah. You don't see how when I eyes make danger. Never join my hustle with the bad mind. Let me say I was no street boy, I be good boy, turn bad. Never turn your back on me if you see me in danger. This is the reality, but nobody say I get a choice. We from the ghetto, kind of life, we nobody say we have a choice. Judge me, brother, man. Make you never ever judge me, brother, man. You know, be God, you know, be God, you know, be God. You know, be God, you know, be God, you know, be God.